Hey everybody, welcome to Shelly P Gaming again. We're getting on in the episodes and we see here that Juventus are going to steal Horiburg. Hopefully he comes in real life. He's a flipping good player. Committed anywhere he goes. Plays well. ex Bayern Munich man. Tottenham Hotspurs man. Just sitting on the bench, rotting away there. I don't know why their coach is not using him, but anyway. It is what it is. We'll take the link. Thank you very much. And he is going to be a super added benefit to this team. I cannot believe it. I cannot tell you how good this guy is. There he is. Footsteps are through the door. Welcome. I do not know why. Massimo's got an English... England FA badge on again. I really don't understand why the game does this. I mean, I don't even have the English job in 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 the national team. Hoiberg, yeah, meeting the stars. Brim is like, does this even lift? Like, look at those arms, Hoiberg. Mm. Nice man. Everyone out there, thank you for watching my last episode. Over 50 views. Hey. Thank you so much. Transfer in. And this this is the next team we need to steal some players from. L Olympic Lyonnais last in the Farmers League. Look at the star players. I'm thinking of Talia Fico. Like I said, mm, good good players to add to our squad. Doesn't mean they're necessarily gonna play. But Giovanni Los Chalso. Also, another man we're going to come in and steal. Spurs, just sitting there. A couple of signings that get me excited is Mashabili, for future of the series, Correa, Duro, Amrabari, Dia, oof. Sometime or another you're going to play for Juventus. Lino, Enrique, fourth, Romero, Romero, Danso, and Edgar. Totti Gomez at the back. Romero, oh. Benya. But anyway, we made a mistake here, so we're winning 3 0. After that, we got too excited after our future transfers there that we didn't press record after the first three goals against the Swallow. But as you can see, we're way more comfortably beating them today. I say that and Barardi goes on a run. Nobody can touch us though. All of a sudden, just when you guys join, the viewers join. Barardi's in to make it 3-1. Can you believe it? We played some of the squad fringe players. Should I say, fringe is a way better word. Didn't want to. Burardi again. Chesney getting down low. We win 3 1. Chiesa with the hat trick. So he didn't miss much. He had three shots and he scored three goals. Burardi scored one. So walking away. We struggled against him earlier on in his career mode. Seems like we getting going, yeah? Seems like we're on the front foot. As long as we're moving forward and laugh. That's good. Juventus 57 points, Solis is 16. There he is, Hoiberg, getting off the bus to join us. Took him a week to get here. We are stealing absolute gems. Kempembe, also sitting on the bench in France, rotting away. World Cup winner from PSG to Juve. And one for the future to watch. Zabelos is here. 
the Argentine has joined to light up the league. Talking about Argentine, see how we go with Giovanni Lo Celso. Coming under, under a whopping four years. Actually, that's not even a lot nowadays. Yeah, Chelsea signing players on eight, nine year, ten year deep. Just to make sure you have to pay it off. You they haven't learned that yet apparently. I'm excited about this one. Him and Hoiberg in the middle of the park. What an upgrade. Rabio is leaving us. Which in the beginning hurt me, but I'm over it now. Two players for the price of one. The Derby. Today, two sides with a rich history are awaiting a clash that will have fans and pundits alike talking for weeks to come. This is surely a match that will go down in the history books. Don't go anywhere. All the action coming up next. A wet night in store for all concerned. Good evening and welcome. Derby della Mare is off at the Coppa Italia. Oh, here's a playing a one-two there with Mukata. Torino are tough. They got good players. Lasic, ex West Ham man. I think he's still on loan now. Chesney with an early touch, four and a half minutes in. Rolls it out. Hoiberg touches the ball nice and early. Oh, he's seen him. Oh, Dusan. Balovic, power shot. First shot, first goal. Under six minutes. Dusan, Balovic. Still scoring goals, left, right and centre. That pass for Chiesa was also spotted well. Hoiberg, you can hit them. Robertson, can he keep it in? Yes, he can. A little bit of skill there. Oh, Kiesa back to Robertson. Robertson. Oh, Dusan. Oh, that was going to be a good team goal, second goal. Playing well, yeah. Milinkovic Savic. Also, one I'm looking at to bring to Juventus with his brother. Maybe his brother can twist his arm to get him back in Serie A. But at the moment, it's Locatelli. Let's focus on now. Albanzi gives it away. And Felipe Luis. Hoiberg. Convempe. Oh, just misses out. Bremer. Luis. Oh, dear. Valovic. Not Valovic, sorry. Valasic. Getting me tongue tied, yeah. The Croatian. Good goal there. Good follow up. Staying awake. Coppa Italia is lit up now. One or Chesney with a good save, but he actually palmed it straight into the path of the Torino man. Locatelli just signing a new deal in real life. What a player he is. He can play anywhere in the middle. I think you're putting him at centre back for one or two games just to see how that goes as well. Locatelli. Robertson out wide. This game got a good pass. Kostic, what a save by Scherz. Good save, good block, Scherz, another save. The serve, Kostic. Oof. Well done, Z. He can hit a ball, he doesn't hit it this time. However, he bends it straight at. Linkovic Savage. Interesting save. Keeps him in though. Oh, the tackle. Dusan. Dusan can bounce. Just giving us chance after chance. Kempempe wins the ball. Hit again. Well done there. <laughs> yes, please. Crazy left boot. My goodness. What a wonder goal. What a goal. Please, can we see that again? Please, please, please. Don't let me see one of those times you skip. Oh, yeah. Kempempe with the hard work. Look. As that. Way out of the box. Oh. Banja Malinkovic Savage. No way. 
Good hit there, he's back. Phew. Massimo was back. Oh. Just before a stroke of half time. Can you believe it? So that gives us enough confidence to bring on some of the changes. Boy, is this a penalty now? It doesn't look good. There we go. First game. First red card. Can't believe it. Hopefully outside the box is always in hope for now. Okay. So at least it is. Four. the corner at Torino straight to Valanji shares surely he can't hit it Betty Valanova do so horrible ball Kostic coming back Richie oh whoosh Absolutely smash Belanova down the wing, yeah? Oh, Belanova cuts him. Oh, what a save. He's in a good run of form. Ricky goes long. Mbanzi wins the header. A to a Torino lad. An attack or Kone. A new French star. Oh, 1 2 with him. Oh, he still gets it back to Dusan. Dusan first time, well done, Zan. That's all I'm saying. Grazie per aver accettato il nostro invito. Ladies and gentlemen, one massive surprise signing from La Liga. The Argentine World Cup winner, Cunha. Chesney and Valovic are like, geez, how many players are we going to bring in? But we do need to freshen up the squad a lot, guys. So Cunha's here. And I mean, Sevilla also struggling in real life, so I thought, why not? Bring him in for Costage. He's going to have me. After all our signings, we need to make up <coughs> as Juventus face Inter Milan in the Derby d'Italia. This is one of the biggest games for us. Smashed them last time, 3-1 I think. But yeah, now we're going to take...
Matea, Enzo, and Artur on loan. So, I mean, yeah, we've got Chesney and Loris, Acuna's there, and Zabelos. Put all of that aside, this is what it looks like. With the lost Chelsea, Roberton, Kostic, Kempempe stepping in, Hoiberg, Chiesa, and Dusan Valovic. I mean, it's a great team, but something is missing. I don't know what's missing in this team. I don't know what to do for that final click of the puzzle. And then this is the other team. Jorginho wants to leave, apparently. Acuna. If I put Acuna in the midfield and he goes up by like nearly to a 90 rated player with Rugani, Sando, Dusan versus Lissandro. It looks like he's got a massive chest, man. Yeah, 3 1 last time we played them. We're playing at the San Siro now. Not the easiest of places to go. Tony Cruz is there now with Jared Moreno. Just those two players. Those are two massive players there. Good striker, one of the best midfield players in the world, central midfielder, Tony Cruz. You can link that team together. And happy November, everyone. So if you go like this, it's November. But let's get into this Derby di Italia. stadium that absolutely oozes history here we are at the San Siro in Milan I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and my partner ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk is Stuart Robson and the focus is very much on Serie A the top division here in Italy it's Inter and they take on Juventus well thanks Derek as always the scene is set two good teams great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere has all the ingredients for a really exciting game at the Inter team, Jan Zoma is the goalkeeper, Toni Kroos starts alongside Nicolo Barella in the centre of midfield and leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays with Gerard Moreno and this is how Juventus will line up well it's a 3-5-2 but the key player is the holding midfield player not only does he protect the back three he also is their link up man when they play out from the back now that'll be a free kick no, Tony Cruz with this one into Di Marco. We got Barella. Robertson gets it away. Dusan Valovic. Oh, can you find Chiesa, the speedster? Chiesa. Oh, he finds Lo Celso. Two hit. Oh, no. Oh, it's an end goal now. Didn't quite make it. You must have known how close we were opening it up. Di Marco. Tony Cruz, give and go, Gerard, Moreno, Gerard Moreno is quick, the left foot, shoots, oh, she's mm, a robotic save, Tony Cruz wins it back, Tony Cruz dangerous, Kempempe, Martin Cruz, Roberton, loses Di Marco, Di Marco in, yes, we work away, in the escape route, give the ball to Dusan Valovic, yes, a uh, bad ball by me, there we go. Bremer out of position. Marco seen a lot of the ball. Just a, a similar formation to us. Costage being out. Demarco. Moreno! What a save down low, but we are in trouble now. Kimpempe. One red card, one appearance. No, oh, Tony Chris, the German, can hit this. Probably go straight in. Please take it quite right. Oh. I knew it. I had a feeling that Tony Cruz was going to be the difference. Man, oh man, oh man. Moreno. 
Now we have to fight back now from Tony Curtis's masterpiece. But I can't seem to touch the ball in this flipping thing. Oh, fancy footwork by Martinez. Come on, man. Everything is going wrong. Yeah, straight to him. What a pass. Clown. Barella and Cruz. Moreno. Martinez gives it away. He still can't get it away. Martinez dribbles the living daylight. Jared Moreno with the finish. Making it 2 0. Yep. It looks like we're out of this game. Everything I've done has not been good enough today. Second half now. Gears are trying to do it by himself and it doesn't go in store. That's in a nutshell what we've been going through. So close. It can't do anything. Marcelo. Mark and Bimpe. Maretti. Soba. Demarco. Cruz. In the heartbeat of this game. Morella. Oof, one, two. Nice to do. Morella. Quadrado, our ex player. Seems like he's on the winning side today. Oh, come on. Moretti. He's got a chance to stuff it up. He does. Cunha. Bad game to come into. My goodness. I just don't know what it is. Maybe it's the chemistry of all the new players being added or what, but this is not in the script. Quadrado. Oh, he's beating his man. Good cross. Martinez. Uh oh. Straight to Lutaro. Moreno. Gonna score. What a tackle. Really thought he was gonna score his breaks there. Tony Cruz whips it in. Moreno again, man. Moreno just wants to score against us. Flipping. Tony Cruz again, too close to Chesney. Safe this time at least. And Chesney gives it straight back. Like we haven't had enough problems. And then we give another foul away. In an area where Tony Cruz can score again. Cruz hits the side next to him. Barella. Or oh, into Milan. 70 minutes of one or two chances. And then the rest has been into Milan. Hoiberg. Oof, he gets a pass away just in time. Playing advantage. Kimpempe. At least he's on the field for the full 80 minutes, it looks like. Hoiberg. He gives it. Gives it. Oh, Moiskin. Moiskin's going to score one back. you got to be flipping kidding me. 89 minutes and that was our last chance. Do we have one more? Two minutes added. Kostic. It looks like we're going to have last chance. Gears. Gears. Yes, if I'm Moiskin. Moiskin. No, Gears. Man, I can't believe this. That's it. That's all she wrote. The old lady. Losing it to San Siro against Inter Milan. Ringrazio per aver accettato di venire ai nostri microfoni.
I mean, it sucks to end it off on a note like that, but thanks everyone for watching. So close to 100 views on the last video. You people are amazing. Thank you so much. And now it looks like we're going to take some nuts here in the next episode in the Coppa Italia. Corofano. Oh my gosh, we can't miss that. 22 goal involvements, matches, goals, assists. Can you believe it? Double figures for both, Nelly. Thank you, everybody.